welcome to Fat Quarter Shop Floss Tube. Today is Stitchy Talk, where on the first Tuesday of every month, I talk a little bit about cross stitch. Now, last month we talked about Ada, and next month we're going to talk about linen. But today we are going to focus on even weave. And so we're going to talk all about even weave. I'm going to talk all about um, the definition of it, even weave counts, even weave brands, and different color options. Now, I'm gonna hold all questions until the very end so that I make sure I get all of um, my facts in. And um, so if you have a question, just pop it in and we will get to it. So um, today we're talking all about even weave. And um, if you are wanting to move from Ada to another cloth, even weave would be the best step. Linen would be the step after. So let's talk about what even weave is. So even weave fabrics are basically even. The, this, the same number of stitches per inch vertically and horizontally and all of these little thread thicknesses are the same. So you'll learn next month that linen isn't always even, but even weave is. So in even weave, you don't count the squares Rather, you count these little threads and you usually stitch over two. Even weave is softer than Ada, and we are going to talk about the different ones that are softer and ones that are not as soft. You typically stitch over two threads, which is called stitching over two, and we're going to show you an image. So, stitching over two, when I talked about the threads, you go over two with even weave and stitching over one would be on the right which is what you do with Ada. So when you're stitching over two you're skipping every other hole. Now your different counts of fabric will determine how many strands of floss you use and what size needle you need. So what you can do is go to our cross stitch calculator put in your put in um, maybe your stitch count and the size of your even weave on the right, and that will tell you what size needle we recommend and how many strands of floss to use. So you can always go to fatquartershop.com and go to our cross stitch calculator to get, so if you have any questions on the needle size or fabric size, I'm gonna refer you to our cross stitch calculator. So now I'm gonna kind of show you we're going to start with just this one real quick. So how do you know what size count your fabric is? So you can either count or you can use a cross stitch key. This one is 25 count white. And I'm going to kind of show you what, what I do. So you kind of want to start with one hole right there and you can just count with your needle or if you just look these little lines line up exactly with the cross stitch key so you know this is 25 count and you know it's not 28 count because nothing is lining up but if you want to look at 28 count this is 28 count and you can tell it lines up and so you can see when you're looking at this even weave it is even the number and thickness of the strands this way and this way are exactly the same we'll talk about linen next week and i mean next month and linen is not even so now let's talk about common even weave counts So the most common even weave counts that we sell at Fat Quarter Shop are 25 count, 28 count, 28 count is equivalent to 14 count Ada. So if you were stitching on 14 count Ada or 28 count even weave, they would come out the same size. 32 count is also popular and that is equivalent to 16 count. So um, 
the 25 count, your piece would be the largest, and 32 count, your piece would be the smallest. So these are the most common sizes we sell at Fat Quarter Shop. I would say our 25 count sells the best, 28 count says, sells the second best, and that's because a lot of our customers are beginner cross-stitch. So that wouldn't be the same for every store. So now that we've talked about counts, let's talk about different brands of even weave. So we're gonna start with the very basic. DMC Charles Craft makes a fabric called Monaco. And you've probably heard of Monaco. That is what Priscilla and Chelsea use. And they take this fabric and dye it. Now there used to be a black Monaco, but that is no longer available. So DMC Charles Craft, their even weave is called Monaco. You can find this at most local craft stores. It's made of 100% cotton, which is gonna be, the this is material, it's gonna, you're gonna see different ones. Now, anything that's 100% cotton is gonna be stiffer than other fabrics. Now, if you wanna work with stiff or less stiff is a personal preference. So um, the reason Priscilla and Chelsea like it so much is they like the stiffness. At that quarter shop, it comes pre-packaged in a tube on a standard 20 by 24 inch size. Monaco is only available in 28 count and it comes in three colors, white, tea dyed, and antique white. So those are the three colors available now. You might be able to find some that's older in different colors. Um, they've kind of whittled it down to this. So, this one is gonna be your least expensive. It will also be your stiffest. And if you want to be on a budget, but you want more colors, you can always hand dye it. And just remember, if you hand dye something, it will shrink the fabric. So this is Charles Craft Monaco 100% cotton. Now we're gonna to move to Zweigart. Now, like I said, DMC, they name their even weave Monaco. Swigart has two different brands of even weave, Lugana or Linda Cloth, and I'm gonna talk about both. So Zweigart makes the most amount of cloth. They're the most well-known in the industry. We sell this at Fat Quarter Shop in pre-cut sizes, and also we sell it by the yard. Depends on what color. You can always tell what Zweigart is because it has the orange stripe. There are tons of colors available and the sizes available are 25, 27, 28, and 32. They do have a lot of colors available and some of them are available. Some of the sizes and some of the prints are available in um, specialty prints like a check or a splash. Zweigart refers to their even weave as Lugana for 25, 28, and 32. Now these right here that are Lugana are 52% cotton and 48% viscose. Now this is not as stiff as um, DMC. This is probably the most popular brand by far. You would be able to find this in most, uh, in all needle workshops. So you can see the stiffness. This is much more movable than this. Okay, so Lugana is 52% cotton and 48% viscose. Now Linda, which is their size 27, is 100% cotton. So this Linda cloth is the same texture as the DMC Monaco. 
but the Linda is a tiny, it's the same material, but it is not not as stiff as Charles Craft. Now, if I was going to start on something even weave, I would start out with the 25 or the 28 count Lugana from Zweigart, if that was what I was starting with. So the Linda, just so you know, it's going to be stiffer because it is 100% cotton. And this would be um, like a very standard priced fabric and it would be, um, you know, a great price, a great, this is probably the most popular. So now I wanna show you some Lori Holt fabric. So Lori Holt fabric is available at Fat Quarter Shop. And what Lori did is she went through the Zweigart catalog and she picked colors that work well for her color palette. And she is offering them in pre-cut sizes in 25 count. Most of the colors come in a piece that's 18 by 27. The prim fabric comes in a larger piece that's 27 by 36. And so this is the same quality because it is Weigart. She just changes the name and makes it where it's very easy to find fabrics that you know will match that style if you like that style. So these are Lori Holt's colors. She's got prim, blackboard, overcast, oatmeal, and cloud. And right now she only has the 25 count in the even weave. So now we're going to move to Witchell. So Witchell calls their even weave Jobelin. This is available at most needlework shops. It comes pre-packaged 18 by 27. Some of the colors we sell by the yard. They were so Witchell refers to their even weave as Jobelin and it comes in only two sizes, 28 or 32. Jobelin is made up of 51% cotton and 49% rayon, and it is softer than Lugana. So the softest even weave you can get is probably Jobelin. And it is a very um, reasonable price and lots of colors. So those are the big brands. Now I'm gonna move to smaller company brands. These next brands are small businesses that, hand, that add hand dyed or screen printing to the base fabrics made by larger companies we discussed earlier, resulting in some beautiful fabric offerings. They are usually more expensive since they were originally a base cloth and now they have been added to. So we will start with Fabric Flare. They have tons of interesting and unique prints it's available at Fat Quarter Shop and some needlework shops. At Fat Quarter Shop, we sell it pre-packaged in Fat Quarters or One Yard pieces. Some of them we only have in Fat Quarters, some we have in bigger pieces. Now, Fabric Flare offers their even weave in 28, 32, and 36 so those are the only three sizes and I don't know what base cloth they start with nobody knows so um, theirs is slightly different than the others um, so fabric flare looks like it is hand dyed but it's printed on one side to give it a hand dyed effect they also have geometric and floral prints and marble type prints you will always know which side to stitch on since one has the design and one is white. Um, I would say Fabric Flare and Zweigart have similar stiffness, but I'm not sure the content of this fabric. I'm not sure it, you know, what percentage is of cotton, which percentage is stiffness. Um, I love the style of this fabric and I do um, really like all of their board fabrics. And this is the only company that Fat Quarter Shop offers that has 36 count in even weave. So you might see 40 count, but that's a linen. 
So in even weave, the smallest you can get at Fat Quarter Shop is Fabric Flare 36 count. Now the next is just hand dyed overall. And there are a lot of hand dyed companies, a ton. The, we sell a lot of them. The ones we sell the most are Picture This Plus, Fiber on a Whim, Fortnite Fabrics, and there's, there might be a couple of others. So what I wanted to say is Picture This Plus has a one year delivery. So when we order, it takes one year to get the fabric which means it's very popular and that's why it sells so much because the demand is high and the supply is small. So when you have that, it's gonna sell faster. So if you ever see Picture This Plus at Fat Quarter Shop or in your needlework store, if you are not sure if you should buy it, you should buy it because I will not have it again very much. But I wanted to let you know, Picture This Plus is dyed on a Zweigart base. All needlework shops will have this. It's available in the traditional Lugana 28 and 32. This is custom hand dyed fabric. Now, if you buy this piece and then you buy another piece, they will not be the same because it is actually hand dyed. Most of the brands come surged so you don't have to worry about fraying. Now this is a very soft draped. It's the softest of all of the fabric brands. So it is softer than the Witchell because it is already washed. So it has that softness, kind of like if you were doing laundry, it's really soft. It is, even though it says it's 28, it will be slightly smaller because it has been washed. And here are just some different colors of, um, and there's Picture This Plus, Fiber on a Whim. So this is Bramble, Shale, Glacier, and Phoenix. So this is just some examples of some hand dyed. And I would say, um, I would work with hand dyed after you get a hang of using something like a Swigart or a Witchell, um, get that, get that kind of, down before you move to this. So now that we've talked about brands, I was gonna move to colors. So let's talk about neutrals. These are the most commonly used, um, and this was just picked by Cheryl, me, and Denise. So this is what we think is used the most by designers. This is Zweigart, 25 count vintage country mocha. One side is modeled, one side is plain. So 25 count, this color also comes in 32 count. White 25 count Lugana is used a lot, and this is Weigart. Mushroom is a really nice color. This is 28 count Zweigart. It um also comes in 25 counts so you can get the mushroom in 25 or 28. Let me go this way. Platinum is really nice. It's third this is 32 count Lugana. And so the platinum looks a little bit grayer. And then Light Topes Weigart is something that I use um, for my Valentine items from Heart and Hand. And this one used to be called Wheat. Now it's called Light Taupe. And then another popular color is Prim by Lori Holt in 25 count. So this would be a great thing to screenshot. Your, um, your Vintage Country Mocha is more of a brown. Your white is a true white. Um, if you wanted to go in different shades, maybe I could put it in shade order. So for your browns, your lightest would be platinum. And it's kind of, this would, it's not gray, but it would work if you're wanting to go with um, something that's not so brown, the mushroom. 
So these are popular colors. And then now I'm gonna move to the best sellers at Fat Quarter Shop. So we had Kevin run a report on all even weave. And you're gonna notice all of these are 25 count because 25 count sells the best at Fat Quarter Shop. So what I'm showing you is the best sellers at Fat Quarter Shop. It obviously wouldn't be the same at every store. So Barley is our number one seller. Cloud, which is white, is the second one. Oatmeal by Lori Holt is the third best selling. Pebble by Lori, actually all of these are Lori Holt. All five of these are Lori Holt. So Lori Holt Vintage Cloth Barley, Lori Holt Vintage Cloth Cloud, Lori Holt Vintage Cloth Oatmeal, Lori Holt Vintage Cloth Pebble, and Lori Holt Vintage Cloth Parchment. Those are our best sellers. So best seller, second best, third best, fourth best, fifth best. Now I'm gonna show you five that I use the most. So these are just ones that I have used the most and they're all 25 count except for one. So I like to use 25 count oatmeal, cloud 25 count. So I am using this on my temperature. The prim 25 count is great if I need something larger than normal because it comes in a bigger piece. The light taupe is what I was saying um, I use on my heart and hand valentine. And if you join me tomorrow, you will see what I made yesterday using this cloth. And then overcast, which is a gray by Lori Holt. So these are some great options for you. Now that we've covered even weave, I'm going to first start with questions that um, came in before. And then I'm gonna move to questions that have come in since. And if you have a question, go ahead and drop it in. So I answer the questions and then we just end when, um, when I answer all of them. So one of the questions we got from beforehand was, is this soft or stiff fabric? So Linda and Monaco are the stiff, stiffest even weave because they are 100% cotton. Linda is stiffer than Lugana. Jobelin is the softest. Now, another question we got is, which is better, soft or stiff? And that is a completely personal preference. So um, it really depends. You know, Priscilla and Chelsea like stiff. Lori Holt likes softer. I like just plain Lugana. I, um, it just depends on what you personally like. Even weave is not hard to stitch on. Um, I would just say my tip for if you're starting with even weave is go slow, use a light, and start with 25 count because that is the easiest to see. And just like anything else in life, if you start with something that's easy, you grow your skills and then you can move on to harder things. Can you stitch a square project on hand dyed fabric? Does the warp shrink differently than the weft, thus making the fabric no longer square? So I would say technically it should come out square. Realistically, it depends. I will tell you, it depends on the stitcher. When I stitch stuff, I will start with the same exact fabric as Cheryl and mine comes out different. And I think it's because I pull my fabric when I'm stitching in hand and she uses a hoop she uses the nerd hoops and hers comes out the right size, mine does not. And you'll wanna make sure you join us on March 14th because that's when we are gonna talk about linen. Okay, so let's go to the very beginning questions. When even weave or Ada are hand dyed and so, okay, are hand dyed, okay. Okay, so if something is hand dyed and it's 28 count, is it really 28 count or is it smaller due to shrinkage? So if it is hand dyed, it will have shrunk slightly. They do not start with like a 32 count and then they actually start with 28 count. So when it shrinks, it's gonna shrink and it would, I guess, just depend on how much it shrinks. 
Thank you to Kitten and Stitches. She says, good morning. Nothing like some stitchy talk with Kimberly before my workout. Oh, thank you. I need to work out. Will the shop do sampler bundles to buy? Samples of Ada, even weave linen would be a wonderful resource to have at home. That is something we've thought about. It's not very cost effective and um, we don't really have like, that's something I wish the manufacturers would do because that would, that I do agree that would be great. We haven't figured out a way to make that work because we don't really have like a system for samples yet. Is even we've not considered the same as Ada because of the material texture. I'm just unclear on how to tell the difference. Yes, so totally different. So Ada has a lot of threads. Linen, I mean, even weave has one strand. So it's just a totally different material. On the 25 count Lugana cloud that I'm using for Barn Sweet Barn, is that even weave? Yes. So Lugana, Linda, Jobelin, those are all even weaves. Carol says, I have questions about how to best make my stitching need on smaller even weave. My threads tend to fuzz up after a few days. So I would say start with a shorter amount of thread so that it goes through less times. I would also say that the stiffer the fabric, the more it's going to pull at your threads. Can I show a up close of Charles Craft Monaco? Yes, I can, Kay. Why don't we put um, a Lugana next to it? So this is Monaco and it's very stiff. This is Lugana and you can see that like one drapes and one does not. Diana says, maybe Kimberly will cover this, but I would like to know how do you stitch over two versus one and how many threads should you use? So we're gonna cover that in a future video about how to stitch over two and um, the number of threads you should use go to our cross stitch calculator just because that is kind of complicated. Is Lori Holt Oatmeal 25 count exactly the same as Country Mocha, Vintage Country Mocha 25 count Lugana? Yes. Which ones come in larger sizes? So Lugana Prim, Prim Lugana comes in a larger size. I believe we have some Vintage Country Mocha in larger sizes. Now what we do is if it's a very popular fabric, and people would like larger, we will offer larger. We only offer larger sizes and a few of them just because most people who shop at Fat Quarter Shop are just shopping for something small. If they're looking for something gigantic, they would probably go to their needlework store. Does the soft fabric stretch? I think all of the fabric, depending on how you hold it, will stretch more or less. So when I stitch in hand, I do feel like mine shrinks more. You can ask Denise all about that because one day I did a, um, I did something and she was like, can you please come upstairs? I think this is off by an inch. And I was like, what? Anyway, my stuff was really different than Cheryl's. Ilsa says, what can we do when you have a project that doesn't fit in Lugana 36 count because it's too wide and not too tall? I know it's a weird problem, but I don't have anyone else to ask. So I would just buy a bigger fabric. And if you can't find the fabric at Fat Quarter Shop, you can go to another store and try to find it. Um, we don't always have the largest. So that's what I would say is, you know, that. Karen asks, is there a right or wrong hole to come up through when starting to stitch? No, I don't think so. 
If there is, I don't follow it. I'm using the DMC pack I bought from Fat Quarter Shop using 25 count cloud for barn sweet barn. One strand over one. I've used Lori's beeswax, but my thread is knotting over and over. I've changed it over. Okay. So if you're stitching one over one, use a very short, instead of using a long thread, use a short thread. The shorter thread is what's gonna help you there. A slightly bigger needle will widen the hole a bit as thread goes through. Results in less drag and less wear on the thread. That is a great tip, Marlene. Which Zweigart color is compatible to Lori Holt Cloud? That would be Zweigart White. What is the frame piece on Kimberly's left on the top shelf with XO? That is Snapshots by Pine, Pine Mountain Designs, February. Let's see, okay, so uh, I think that's it. That's all the questions you guys have. So thank you so much for joining me for Stitchy Talk to talk about Even Weave. Now, of course, if you have any questions on Even Weave, please put them in the comments and we will answer them. And thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you tomorrow.